Having trouble with navel orange worm in the orchard? Sidetrack, now miso mating disruption is your best bet to minimize loss and maximize profitability. Used with Tresse's new multi-gender lures for your monitoring program, you can achieve the quality yields you deserve. Contact your local sales rep today. Hello, I'm Matthew Malcolm with Pacific Nut Producer Magazine reporting to you from the Kearney Ag Center. I'm here with Themis Michaelitis, plant pathologist uh, from the UC. I wanted to speak uh, specifically about walnut mold, which has become a, an increasing problem for walnut growers in recent years. About how to identify and recognize this in the orchard and how to mitigate it to, uh, to maximize your profitability in the orchard from your crop. Walnut mold uh, is a problem that has been uh, uh, severe in the last uh, um, uh, several years and the concern is that growers are losing significant amounts of uh, nuts uh, because of the mold. Um, thus, uh, the Walnut, California Walnut Board uh, started supporting research uh, to try to mitigate the problem. So the major uh, causes of walnut mold are fungi that belong in the gen genera uh, Altenaria, Fusarium, and Aspergillus niger, but also we can find uh, Bogeosphere and Formops causing uh, mold. So uh, there are several factors uh, that uh, increase mold, and one is uh, uh, we found out that uh, walnut blight the bacterial disease that's a major problem in walnuts in California and in other countries um, it predisposes somehow to um, uh, infection by the fungi. Also, we have insect infestation, sunburn, the large level of the large osteol of the walnuts also contribute to uh, walnut mold. So to mitigate this problem, uh, we uh, did experiments in which we showed that when we uh, uh, apply fungicides uh, pre-hole sp split uh, at pre-hole split stage or during the early hole split, we can reduce the mold. All the um, uh, experiments show that this approach is very promising. We had significant uh, uh, reduction of mold and uh, thus we want now to proceed to identify the best time for application of these uh, fungicides at that, uh, during that period of time. One thing that I would like to say is that the fungicide sprays you do to control botrysphere and formopsis uh, canker blight, it's, uh, they seem to reduce uh, botrysphere in the nut uh, as mold, but they do not reduce the mold caused by alternating fusarium. That is why we need the pre-hole split sprays or during the early split, uh, early hole split uh, sprays. Thank you, Themis. Read more about these things in Pacific Net Producer Magazine. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgNet.com.